It's fall. October is here and basketball is back. Kyle Hoffman here with Terry Vision with men's basketball head coach Mike Young. Coach Young, first practice here today. Are you pleased? How are, what are your thoughts on this first practice here today? Yeah, I'm pleased. Kyle, I, I think if you're displeased after uh, the first practice, you're probably in for a long one. Um, pleased with um, you know how hard they worked and uh, we had a good preseason. We come into it uh, healthy. Uh, we've got everybody in uniform and you know, they're geared up and uh, the coaching staff is uh, excited. Uh, nice to be back out here. Uh, we played awfully fast as uh, we typically do early in the year and it'll take us a, a good while to, uh, you know, get it smoothed out and slow everybody down and uh, you know, have people seeing things the way that we want them to see it. But, um, you know, in, ter in terms of uh, energy and focus and uh, willingness to, you know, make the, the right play, uh, that was evident from uh, start to finish, and that's uh, always a positive. It was, and is that a thing that is most key at this time of year is really just attention to detail and making sure the new guys and everybody else is getting back up to speed there? Yeah, I mean, we got six new guys, and um, I think eight, uh, nine uh, freshmen and sophomores, which is a, you know, a young group, and as young as we've been in, in recent memory, uh, so, you know, uh, to um, for us as a coaching staff to slow down and uh, and understand that uh, you know we've got some you know new guys out there on the floor that uh, are uh, unaccustomed uh, you know how we play and uh, what we're looking for uh, a little more teaching than uh, than we've had to do here in quite some time but you know that is uh, that is a part of coaching and um, uh, they listen well and they've got big eyes and and they want to do the right thing. Um, and, uh, you know, it'll be a, a daily, you know, work in progress, but um, certainly excited about uh, our team and, uh, you know, the young people that we have uh, brought in here. You talk about the young team, and you've got some veteran status still on this team, with, especially the point guard, Eric Garcia. Talk about Eric and how important he is to really acclimate the entire offense and get especially the defense as well, and get these guys uh, back up to speed. You know, I go back uh, even four years prior to E uh, with Losing. I've got to be one of the luckiest people in America to have two point guards of that caliber. Garcia is terrific, um, and he is the consummate Wofford guard. He's tough as a knot. Uh, he's a terrific shooter. He never turns the ball over. Uh, he's, you know, helped us hang two uh, banners up there, and, um, you know, he's poised uh, for – uh, you know, to have a great senior year and for our team to have a, a great, uh, great year as a club, uh, he'll have a lot to do with it and uh, awfully proud of the work that he put forth this summer back home in Denver to prepare himself for, you know, his, uh, his, his last year here at, uh, at Wofford. Here with Terriers point guard Eric Garcia. And Eric, just talk about your feelings of today and how practice went for all of you guys. Um, I was proud of, proud of everybody. I thought everybody worked hard, especially the younger guys. So today was a lot of teaching. Um, coach had to, you know, teach the younger guys uh, a lot of the stuff we do. So uh, today was a little bit slower, but as we get going, uh, things will pick up. Yeah, and over the summer, uh, is there anything in specific that you really tried to work on your game and bring to the table for this season at all? Uh, I just tried to become an overall better player. Um, just. Uh, shooting, uh, score, most a lot of scoring stuff. Cause I know I'll be uh, uh, asked to score a lot more this year, um, and just you know get my guys involved. But uh, just thankful for everyone back home that helped me. So um, I just I just feel ready going into the season. Speaking of back home, we're going back home for you to Boulder, Colorado, and in the Colorado area, and playing in front of a bunch of family and friends. Are you how excited are you about that to go back to the state of Colorado? Uh, I can't wait. Uh, I mean, I'll be playing in front of uh, a lot of. Uh, friends from high school that have never been to a Wofford game before, uh, a lot of family that can't make it uh, out this way. So it's, it's just going to be fun. I, I never, I rarely get to go home. Um, so to bring my guys uh, uh, to Colorado, it's going to be a fun experience. And it's another season under the shortened shot clock. Talk about how important that is, um, getting the, the team back up, really uh, operating on a fast and high pace level. Yeah. Um, you know, we had to uh, adjust a tad. Uh, we're talking about five seconds. I, uh, did not think that uh, I didn't see a, a, a big difference. We may try to play a little faster in transition um, while holding 
you know, near and dear to those things that, um, that are most important to us, and that's great shot selection, great ball handling. Uh, but, um, you know, uh, we will, uh, you know, continue to tweak that as we move along, but uh, not a lot different from what we saw a year ago. Well, a lot of exciting changes coming. Another exciting season on, on tap for us here at the Benjo. And this is being the last year. Talk about how special this season will be playing our last time here um, at Ben Johnson Arena. Well, it'll be, uh, it'll be great. This building has been uh, terrific to us. You know, I think 28 years. And this was my last first practice uh, in this uh, building, um, a lot of great memories. And I think back and all the times, time that I've spent here, uh, the practices, the shoot arounds, uh, you know, the fun times, uh, South Carolina at home, and I could go on and on and on. Uh, but let's treat it as we treat every year and every day is, you know, is awesome. And every day is uh, with this team is a uh, is a big deal it just so happens to be in you know in a building that we'll say goodbye to at the end of the year um, so you know it'll be a lot of fun I uh, look forward to uh, each day in practice each game that uh, that we have left uh, and let's uh, let's you know today kicked it off absolutely it's good to be back coach let's make this a fun year and uh, thanks for talking to us today Kyle thanks a lot